Diego Rivera in a group of uh, our research and development team uh, have been working for quite some time already, over three years, in implementing processes where we're capable right now not to guess about the quality of the treatment we deliver to a patient, where we're capable right now using uh, modalities of imaging, the capacity of understanding what was the actual delivery of the treatment in a way that we'll be able to change a little bit the paradigm of radiation where a physician prescribe a treatment, we do our best effort to fulfill the needs of that treatment. We, through what we can call conventional procedures of monitoring, which was a very simple imaging in the past, we were able to believe that aligning anatomy was a surrogate of aligning those distributions in order to guarantee that we could do the tumor control uh, with the minimum amount of, of complications. Uh, that, in the retrospective study that actually we're presenting this year, shows that actually is not necessarily true. Uh, what you do on your initial planning and the actual delivery might have deviations that might cause changes on the outcome. In the past, we were not able to do so. We believe that with this tool, which fortunately for us, we're capable to now deploy to every patient in our institution, not necessarily every small group, and we have 100 plus centers in the U.S. at this point, uh, we'll be able to control a little bit more during the course of the treatment, and at the same time understand what modifications we need to do, or how we need to adapt the treatment in order to continually go back to the expected original treatment that the physician prescribed. We believe that uh, we can do that uh, today in what we call the offline process, uh, but everything that been, our R&D team has been working on is being right now directed to the online process, which we'll be able to do it while the patient is on the actual treatment team. Uh, our experience here also is we're very pleased that the vendors are understanding our interest on this. Uh, we know that, that many academic institutions have been working on this too at different levels. What we believe is unique on our site is our capacity to modify the true clinical workflow on every patient uh, that is actually needing this type of adaptive therapy. Obviously, some cases might not be necessary, but a lot of them uh, will have the capacity to do so. And uh, we get a lot of support from vendors who are uh, talking to essentially all of them, and all of them are helping us to develop the tools in order to put this to the access to everybody.